Hello. Hello, family and friends. I'm here today and I'm going to be cooking kale. I've got kale with me. It's from the garden that I'm allowed to go in. And I've got scallions, nice and fresh. And I'm just cutting them up. And I'm going to be steaming fish. I've got brie, I've got sea bass. And I'm going to be working with a salmon head as well. I'm just going slow and I'm going to show you how I normally cook, or I should say steam, sea bass and brie. It can be done on the grill as well, or it can be done in the oven. But for the time being, I'm just going to show you my ingredients and how I work with what I've got. I've got garlic. I'm one of them people that like to pound the garlic with the bottle. <laughs> I just find it easier to do that way. Anyway, I'm gonna cut it up today and put it with the other ingredients and start working with the kale, scallions, garlic, scotch bonnet, pepper, I've got it here, nice yellow one. And I've got some thyme. I'm not gonna cut the thyme, I'm just gonna drop it in, just like that. Um, I will chop the garlic. I like the flavor of garlic, I love garlic so much, I don't know why. One of my granddaughter words when she was much younger and start talking one of them was garlic because she was always in the kitchen <laughs> helping nana and cooking and she learned garlic very fast so that was one of her first words daddy garlic mommy <laughs> i'm the garlic woman I do love garlic. I enjoy cooking with garlic. I've ordered some aprons. They haven't arrived yet. So when they do arrive, I'll be wearing my apron. In the meantime, I've washed the fish, scrape it, clean it. And... It's draining now so I will put the season on it and I will show you how I do it um, just trying to take things slowly hello again and I'm back um, cooking with Nana today as I said, I'm going to be steaming some fish. I haven't seasoned it yet, but I'm, I'm going to walk you through it. And I've cut the thyme. Well, I don't cut the thyme, but I've got thyme. And I've got scotch bonnet pepper. I've got the kale. I've got the I've got onions, kale, the whole lot. So I'm just going to work with this. When it's time, I'm going to show you what I do um I'm just taking it slowly anyway I hope you can follow me I'm normally too fast for you in it <laughs> fast and furious sorry <laughs> but I'm gonna try and go through my videos and go through it slowly and talk you through it and see how I do and how much you like it I hope you do like subscribe and stay with me follow me through I'm on a journey and I'm enjoying it. Today, the day is looking really nice outside. Outside my window, my backyard, lovely trees. I've got a few plants indoor as well. 
and I'm just trying to enjoy life a bit more and count my blessings. I'll be back. I am back everyone. So I've got the fish that I drained. It's nice and dry. I like it cooked, dry, free from water. Just gonna give them another wipe. This is the sea bass. I do I love sea bass. And I like brie. I'll just dry it and I'm gonna add all the dry ingredients to it I'm gonna put a bit of fish seasoning a bit of curry powder and because I've got all the fresh thyme garlic scallion I've even got onion and ginger I know it's gonna be well flavored so I don't need any more seasoning to it. I will still add a bit of salt for flavor, taste. This is the head of the, what you call it, sea bass. And the salmon head. When I eat a sam when I eat half a salmon head, I don't need rice, I don't need yam, I don't need anything keeps me full so I love salmon head and I, I make cuttings in it for the seasoning to go into it yeah so I've got curry powder I've got fish seasoning and I've done my measurement of two spoons I'm adding it to the fish and I've done three spoons of this what you call it fish seasoning that's gonna be marinated in it and I'm just gonna add all the scallions and the things that I've cut up the kale, scallions, um, scatchabani pepper, it's a yellow one, garlic, and I only use half of the pepper because I know scatchabani is really bad. <laughs> and I've got lemon that I'm going to slice because I like to cook with lemon. I know some people serve with it, but I actually cook with it. I cook with lemon and I cook with oranges. So if I don't have one, I have the other. And I, I did wash it. So. And I have a half of onions. I'm going to cut it up and add it to it. just me I love flavor I like to cook with flavor so the onion we had all the seasoning that I need and ginger I cut it very thin 
there's something about ginger it brings out the flavor of other things just wake it up and I love ginger but I am a foodie ain't I <laughs> I love food so I'm going to pour my glove work this season into it I don't like wearing gloves but this time I will okay. I did say I would put a bit of salt and I will I'm gonna put two small teaspoons of salt smell it. Fragrance so good. I'll get some salt. Can you see? We measured it. One. Two. I'm not going to put any black pepper because I already put scotch bar on it. And that's more, more than enough pepper. Oh, should be fabulous. Smells great. going to marinate till later I cook it and I'm gonna walk you through it show you how I do it and I've got a little surprise hello again I'm gonna be I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with the fish I've got a tray I've got foil paper Just open it. So I'm going to Brie, time into it. Yeah, I'm gonna put the head of it. This is a good size head. All right, put some scallions in it. itself it's a bit big put onions garlic stuff it with it then I'm gonna wrap it leave a little hole so it can steam and come out five pieces of this should be one one fish I 
and I'm gonna put the salmon head on it because I know it's good flavor. Scallions, thyme, a bit of lemon, onions, garlic, it's all here. It should be wonderful. Can you see it? All of this. Yeah? It's going to be wrapped and baked. I'm not going too fast for you guys. I keep forgetting I put kale. So there's spring onions, garlic, kale. Find a way to use the kale, which is good. And lemon, ginger. Got it all. Then I'm going to put it in the oven and give it 30 minutes. <laughs> I'll be back. So I'm going to put this in the oven now. It's in the oven on gas mark six. Flavored. Oh. delicious yeah it's all done It 
looks good. Right. So delicious. Soft and lovely. Thanks for watching take care more recipes to come don't forget to like share subscribe and comment feel happy to comment i love the interaction thank you bye